We have the Fat Electrician reviews Cow, uh, Cav Scouts. Model still having issues, hence why it's not up on screen. Okay, fine. We'll talk about the Cav Scouts. This episode is brought to you by Heather, who wanted to give a shout out to her son, Brandon, who's currently in SF selection for the Army. Trying to become Legend. a doctor grunt. Anyways, back to the funny hat gang. Ladies funny and gentlemen, the Cav Scouts are the CrossFit of the United States Army. What? I don't mean that negatively. I just mean they do a little bit of everything, and they're really fucking loud about it. <laughs> Never will you have to ask the question, hey, are you a Cav Scout? Because you'll probably hear them yelling, if you're not Cav, you're not shit, before you even have a chance to ask. Which is fine, <laughs> I still love them. I only love them because they're on my side. Thank God. <laughs> to understand the Cav Scouts, you have to understand where they come from. Cav being short for cavalry, which is a soldier on horseback, like this. Horse. If you don't know, a scout is traditionally a soldier that would sneak ahead of the conventional forces, get eyes on the enemy, and report back with intel. Right. This is where the Cav Scouts originated. And they pay respect to that history by wearing the Stetson. I heard and about the, Spurs. the Stetsons. I They're also known for drinking their infamous grog, which is apparently Bax and Rip It. What? Probably just end the video here. In what is this? I've never heard of this grog. Drink this shit. Don't fuck with them. Okay, no, seriously. So how does a soldier on horseback fit into modern I have warfare? to ask my Cav Scout friend. Give me a second. I need to see if he can make the grog. They would actually kind of function as a mobile infantry. They would literally get flown into a live battle on a helicopter and get dropped off right in the middle of it. There's a great movie on it called We Were Soldiers. You should watch it. Now, somewhere watch between it. Vietnam and now, somebody made the call that Cav Scouts should just get to do whatever the fuck they want. I know that because they have all the cool shit from other jobs that's <laughs> consolidated into one job. They get to use all the cool shit the infantry uses, like the 50 cal, yeah. the Mark 19, Buddy slept with AKA that 50 cal. machine gun that shoots fucking grenades. They get their own mortar crews. Oh yeah, and they get their own fucking tanks. <laughs> but that's not a tank, it's a Bradley fighting vehicle. It looks like a fucking tank It's a me. Bradley fighting. Oh yeah, and they get the cool Wiley Coyote suits that the snipers have. Ladies and gentlemen, if you don't know, there's a giant pissing match between the Cav Scout and every other combat MOS. I love it. But that. in particular, the infantry. Now, if you get the infantry and the Cav Scouts on the same battlefield, oh, God. it just turns into a giant game of who can stack the most bodies the highest. If you, uh, As said, I have a buddy in the Cav Scouts, and uh, it was great. Because he was telling he was telling me about the time when the infantry was out at the range, and his unit was out at the range... And the infantry used twice as much ammo and hit half as many targets as the Cav Scouts did. <laughs> like, from what little I understand in military culture, the fucking pissing match is fucking real. If you've seen Lord of the Rings, it's like the dwarf and the elf competing <laughs> who gets to kill the most things. But you have to remember these are scouts. They're supposed to be there first. Well, there's always a possibility yeah. by the time anybody yeah. else gets there to help, scouts are just sitting there playing Jenga with the remains they stacked. God damn. Damn it, I told you how this is supposed to go. You're the scout, I'm the infantry. You get eyes on them, I stack the body. I tried waiting, but you took too long. Yeah, I'm on foot. Ah, should have got your own tank. Sorry, a fighting vehicle. <laughs> now, while everybody says the Cav Scouts are annoying, everyone is also secretly, deep down, happy that they are on their side. Really that good, though. They are good. likes hearing them yell, if you're not Cav, you're not shit. If you're an American, <laughs> it's annoying. But if you're not an American, the bushes are about to start moving, and a 19-year-old drinking Bex and rip it out of a hat's about to show you that a fighting vehicle is still heavy enough to make you a crunchy. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed my content, would like to buy me a beer about it. There's a link for that right here. A link to my YouTube channel is also there. So until next time, thank you for your service. Quack bang out. God, fucking. I would. Uh, Cav would... Scouts are fucking built differently, is what that fucking is. Okay. Holy shit! I actually just got uh, word back. I guess Buddy was online. I asked him, can you make the Cav Scout grog? And he just goes, not without other Cav Scouts. <laughs> this is a ritual that requires a gathering. <laughs> <laughs> Awe has increased. <laughs> I am only fueled to one day experience the crap.